We in the North have lived the last century in an aquatic paradise. Our water's been abundant, safe, clean, at basically no price, but I'm here to speak the fluid truth, my friend. Our golden age of water has come to an end. In the so-called developing world, we see floods, droughts, people drinking brown water, death and devastation, but that's just a warning. We're all adrift in the same boat. Our rivers and lakes are in a state of ruination. It doesn't matter what part of this planet is your habitation. We got here through mismanagement, blind development, deregulation, a sonic boom in population, deforestation, climate change, and ignorance. We love moon rivers, chasing waterfalls and singing in the rain. But who sings about where water goes when it runs down the drain? We talk about our relationships with friends, family, and our devices, but we don't talk about our relationship with water, its meaning, its value. Guess why there's a water crisis? From rainwater harvesting to smart irrigation, we are in the midst of a tech revolution, and that's a big part of the solution. We need to think about how we use water, how we share it, how it's managed, but what we need most is a change of heart or technology's just a bandage. Water is the fiber that touches all the bases. We are all in deep trouble, and there is no new oasis. Water's problems are complex, but I am here to say they're solvable. Clean water for all is within reach. So let's make ourselves audible. We owe it to Mother Earth, to every mother's son and daughter. Let's talk about water.